Hey guys, Simon Ekpa, the Prime Minister of Biafra government in Nazar, jubilate as some U.S. leaders show support for the declaration of Biafra Nation on the 2nd of December 2024. Okay, uh, alright, this is a good news for Biafrans who are agitating for their freedom. Uh, Simon Ekpa had announced that uh, on the 2nd or the 2nd of uh, December 2024, that is this year, uh -huh. just a few months uh, thereabouts, that they are going to, you know, actualize their nation. They will declare the Biafra nation. Okay. So, according to Simon Ekba in his uh, ex ando okay, he said, uh, some U.S. leaders, U.S. leaders have showed support for the declaration of a Biafra nation on the 2nd of December. <laughs> Nigerians, <laughs> hey, so now like this, like this, this thing don't they go foul. Nigerians government, they thought that this is a joke. They never knew that somebody, we, <laughs> we come from anywhere after they incarcerated the uh, Nam the Kano in DSS custody in the same issue of uh, agitation. Now Simon Ekpa is now waxing very stronger. And the, the, with the look of things, self, Nigerian government they fear because the way this guy they go, okay, he's going far. Now the uh, Nigerian government they don't they talk say uh, some international communities, you know, they support these agitations for Biafra nation, okay, for Nigeria to be divided, okay. Nigerian government said they these nations they get interest too, okay. Not even uh, UK, UK is against this division of Nigeria, okay. Uh -huh. So other lead other uh, world leaders they don't they you know they support this Biafra nation. Uh, declaration and the Biafra struggle. So they are really investing uh, support for the Biafra nation. So this is where Nigerian government is really uh, being scared because they have tried every means possible to make sure that Simon Ekpa is repatriated back to Nigeria. You know, and I know the way when they do, they do Nam the Kano now, but this is really very difficult for them. They could not achieve it. All the possible means when they don't do to make sure that they, they bring back Simon F. But back to Nigeria, they don't fit. You get so Nigerian government, they are now really very scared of this very guy. You get now he's announcing that uh US leaders are in support, you know, of they have showed support for this declaration. His declaration I'm talking about here, his declaration he said. Not be say Biafra struggle declaration. So that means these people they are already prepared. Well, the truth is that interesting times is ahead of us. Even as they, they prepared, no, not see to say Nigerian government they fold their hands. You okay? Because Nigerian government don't talk them. The Nigerian army don't talk them that they can never fold their hands and see Biafra actualize in Nigeria. They will make sure that you know the, it it doesn't happen. You get, and you know what that means. You know what that means. When I know what they do when they introduce Operation Python Dance, one, two, three, all those ones, those dance, Python, Python, Python. In the Southeast, you get. So, now people hate to go still enter this matter. But so this one now, now it's just the latest, you know, update that uh, some U.S. leaders have showed support for the declaration of... Uh, uh, Biafra Nation on the 2nd of December 2024. Meanwhile, the federal government of Nigeria have says it will not entertain any organization of any part of the country. That means it not go allow any where yeah, say they want separate. No, no part of this country is going to go anywhere. So it, it, it also explained that there will be no room for secession. Say Nigeria living together is an ob obligation and not optional. You understand? This is what federal government have said. 
So they said certain groups have, you know, uh, certain groups campaigning to be allowed to exit the Nigeria Union, you know, brought together under the, 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 the separate Southern and Northern Protectorates by Lord Lugard in 1914. It cannot work. Nigeria gained independence from British colonialists in 1960. All right. Uh, the country fought a better civil war for almost three years between 1967 and January 1970. So, Minister of Defense Mohammed Bo Baduru Abubakar reaffirmed the indivisibility of the country during a peace meeting in Plateau State. He said the federal government will not entertain such demand capable of causing division and this affection among Nigerians. So Baduru is a, a former governor of Jigawa state. He also said the government was, well, was highly disturbed that some people would want to disrupt the current um, peace Nigeria is actually you know, uh, experiencing. And that will not happen. So guys, when I don't hear the matter now, just like as I said, even as the Biafra agitators are really working very hard to see that uh, <laughs> this country never divides. The, 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 the Biafra agitators are also working very hard to make sure that they leave. So the thing is that voila, a plenty you get. So guys, at the drop on here, kindly drop your comments below the comment section. Uh, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, share this video, let it go viral. Let Nigerians understand what is happening today in the Nigerian political landscape. Thank you and bye for now.